So uh, when I thought that this match was going to go to the end of the show, I checked to see how much time was left, I, which I did, by the way, at the very beginning of the show. I realized it was a third world or a first world problem. Actually, in the third world is probably irritating too, but <laughs> it's a two hour show, okay? Mm-hmm. A show is 42 minutes if you take out commercial breaks per hour. That comes out to 84 minutes. That's one hour and 26 minutes, okay? I look at this fucking show and it's one hour and 37 minutes. That's correct. I was so fucking pissed off. I was like, I know that like it's a gimmick and then you get the bump from the third hour from the people that are tuning in for the next show. And then you fuck around and you do your goofy stuff to say that Raw actually had more viewers than it really did during the... It's all a gimmick and everything like that, but... That's great for them, and that's great for their pocketbook. But, like, I want to hang out with my fucking kids in the afternoon, and here I am having to watch a show with a... What am I going to do the math here? 13-minute overrun. The show went two hours and 13 minutes. 13 minutes over the top of the hour. And trust me, like, there was some stuff on the show that I really liked, but there was nothing on the show that necessitated this going 13 fucking minutes past the top of the hour. I hate these overruns. Every time I turn on NXT and it goes nine minutes past the top of the hour, it's like, there ain't even another show on the other channel. Like, it's, uh, it's fucking in- infuriating. Just get your show done in two hours so I can get on with my life. All right, so the real main event, and we get the announcers jibber-jabbering for a while as Kurt and RVD are stretched out. Real main event is Rock versus Tess and Stephanie McMahon. Did this need 13 extra minutes? I would say no. no. Well, no. I would say no. No, it did not. Uh, but Stephanie, for the most part, did commentary and interfered here and there and then got it all to finish. So it was basically Rock versus Test. And the Rock rules, so this is like the best Test match you'll ever see. <laughs> so he hits the boot of death, Test does. At this point, Steph demands a tag. She wants to make the cover. Rock kicks out, and the Rock kicking out of her pin hurts Stephanie's back. Yes. <laughs> She's down selling now. She crawls- well, I don't want to. I don't want to be that guy, but like she has enormous breasts. Okay, it puts a lot of strain on the lower back. Rock did sure. point this out earlier in the show as yes, well. Yes, yes. So, yeah. So, so she crawls away from the corner, and Rock threatens to rock bottom her, but Tess breaks that up. Now the match just continues. Tess is not legal. He very clearly came in without a tag, and starts doing stuff with Rock. But Rock throws Test into Steph. She falls off into Booker T's arms. And Rock takes Test, who is not the legal man, hits a rock bottom and pins him. Of all the issues. <laughs> who gives a shit? <laughs> it, I mean, who cares? <laughs> this show was a pattern. Maybe there was a blind tag somewhere that one of the announcers missed. Because they're watching Test and Steph against The Rock. Who cares? I did not need to see this whole match. The, the Rock should not have pinned Stephanie McMahon. Just saying. That's not what I was implying. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Who cares? So cool. What difference did it make if he pinned Steph? Eh. I saw Alexa pin Randy Orton. Trust me, The Rock pinning Steph would be superior. So there's more. Oh, God. <laughs> the Austins are leaving. Cole says... Did you hear? Kurt Angle has a serious neck and back injury. Austin says, I didn't know that. Thank you for telling me, and goes to leave. <laughs> but no, Cole won't leave. We'll let him alone. He says, you may not have an opponent to Unforgiven. And so Austin berates and bullies and emasculates him for a while, and then the show ends. <laughs> If you enjoy these videos, for just $7.99 per month, you can enjoy full-length editions of The Brian and Vinny Show, Wrestling Observer Live, Figure Four Daily with Tom Lawler and Lance Storm, plus hundreds of archived shows, all in beautiful HD. Don't miss out. Join us today.